Hello friends, this video on motion in a plane part 25 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Please make sure that you have watched all the videos from part 1 to part 24 before going ahead with part 25. Let us look at problem 3. It says a bullet fired at an angle of 30 degree with the horizontal heats the ground 3 kilometers away. That means let us suppose you fire a bullet here making an angle of 30 degree with the horizontal. So what happens? It goes, flies high in the air and then comes back to the ground. So it says that if you fire it at an angle of 30 degree, then it will hit the ground 3 kilometers away. That means this distance will be 3 kilometers. Now the question says that by adjusting its angle of projection, so which is the angle of projection? This angle, right? So by adjusting this angle, can one hope to hit a target 5 kilometers away? That means, let us suppose if I tell you that you change this angle of projection, but in such a way that this bullet hits the ground only after 5 kilometers. That means, if you change its angle to some angle say theta, then this bullet should hit the ground at a distance of 5 kilometers from the origin. So the question is asking you, is it possible that by changing the angle to some other angle, you can make this bullet hit the ground 5 kilometers away from the origin? So how do we do that? So and also it is told that assume the muzzle speed to be fixed and neglect the air resistance, right? So in this case, let us first consider the first scenario which is given. Here we are given that theta is equal to 30 degree and also the total horizontal range is equal to 3 kilometers. Right? Now we know that horizontal range R is equal to u square sine 2 theta divided by g. Right? Here we know theta. So this will be u square by g sine 2 theta. Here theta is equal to 30 degree. So this is sine 60. So that means u square by g and this will be root 3 by 2. So this is the value of the horizontal range which comes out in this case. <laughs> now the question says that this range is equal to 3 kilometers, right? So from here we can see that range is maximum. When do we know that the range is maximum? The maximum range that can be covered only when sine theta or sine 2 theta is equal to 1. Right? This is the condition for the range to be maximum. So what would be the maximum range? I mean irrespective of any angle with which you throw the projectile. The maximum range till which it can go would be this R max which will be equal to u square by g. Fine. So irrespective of whatever angle you make it, the angle has to be 45 degree when you want the range. So when we want to calculate the maximum range that is R max, the angle has to be 45 degree. So in that case, R max comes out to be U square by G. So what would be U square by G? We already calculated that U square by G into root 3 by 2 is given as 3 kilometers. Right? So U square by G would be, from this equation we can calculate U square by G which comes out to be U square by G is equal to 3 into 2 by root 3. Right? So this comes out to be 2 root 3. So that means R max is equal to 2 root 3. So this is the maximum range that this projectile can go. So it cannot go beyond this range. Now what does your question ask? Your question says that is it possible to make it travel a distance of 5 kilometers by changing its angle? So it is not possible because it cannot hit the ground at a distance of greater than 2 root 3 kilometers. So if you calculate this 2 root 3 kilometers, it comes out to be 3.46 kilometers. So the maximum distance that this projectile can go is 3.46 kilometers, maybe somewhere up to this distance, but not more than that. So it cannot hit the ground 
फाइव किलोमीटर्स अवे फाइन सो वॉट इज द कॉन्सेप्ट दैट वी यूज इट वी जस्ट यूज द फंडा ऑफ मैक्सिमम रेंज दैट द प्रोजेक्टाइल कैन ट्रेवल so the maximum range for maximum range sin 2 theta has to be 1 so maximum range would be u square by g now given the data of 3 kilometers we found out the value of u square by g which we found as 2 root 3 so since maximum range which we calculated is less than 5 kilometers therefore it cannot hit the target 5 kilometers away thank you please visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thank you once again